this is Austin Plants coming back to you with another tutorial about how to put your trailer on your jig. Let's get into it. The two brands we're going to be using are Netbait and we're going to be using Striking Trailers. So we're going to be using Package Chunk and in Netbait and Tiny Package Chunk in Netbait. And in the striking selection, we're going to be using a rodent. Don't know if you can see that, but that's a rodent. And we're going to be using a rage craw. You can see that. Her rage cell is called rage craw. And I'm going to show you how to put the trailer different trailers on your jigs so what you're gonna do with the tiny chunks like this tiny little chunk and i'll show you the comparison with a real size chunk the real chunk is way bigger like way bigger as you can see so we're going to start off with the tiny chunk. This is the Alabama crawl color. So, what you want to do, since this is chunk. Hold on, I've got a, got a baby jig right here. This is the baby size jig. So, what you want to do is you want to slide that about halfway on. About three quarters almost. And pop it through and pull it up your hook right like that before it reaches the little hook thing and then this is what it looks like in the water I don't know if you can see that yeah you should be able to see it you pop that through the water and let it sink pop it and then your fish comes and bites it you set the hook and You've caught a fish. So, that's the Alabama Craw color. We've got three different colors today, I think. And this is a full size chunk, but I've got a baby jig. So, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to get out a different jig. So, let's grab this jig right here. So, what you want to do, that, this, these jigs, that's a DNL Oops jig, and this is a DNL uh, Cumberland Craw jig. So, you're going to do the same thing, but if you're using the actual size um, chunks, you want to get your full size um, jig do the same thing right like that and drop your little tail same exact thing so let's try and read that um, let's see so now we got a summer crawl color. The rest of the baits, the color is going to be summer crawl. So, let's try to get that the box out of the way. So, you know what you're going to do? The chunk. You're going to do the same thing. do the same thing right like there right before it reaches the uh, little uh, thing where it clamps on right there you just slide that right to there that's what it looks like yeah okay so now to the strike king baits okay Let's see. 
Hmm. Trying to find. There's a strike candy bait. This is the rage crawl. It's on a baby jig, as you can probably tell. You have to pull about, let's see. And you have to pull about three of the little uh, notches off to get that on there. Leaves you with about three notches, two for the body and one for the head. And that's how you get that. That's Strike King uh, Rage Crawl in there. So, what we're going to do now is I'm going to show you how to put the rodent on. And, and the color on that was Summer Crawl. Not enough if you could see that. My color in this is Summer Crawl. See? So you can probably see. Summer Crawl. And it's got like a. It's got like a. Chartreuse color in it. So, what you're going to do. It doesn't matter which side you do this on, but I recommend you put the dark side to the inside of it. So, you're just going to slide your bait. All the way up on there till about, mm, I'd say about there, about to right there, to where you have about that much of your bait left, and then just with this bait, you want to slide it all the way up on there. Same with your uh, rage crawl, all the way up on there. See, I've left no room all the way on in here all the way on and that's it for today's video hope you all enjoyed please subscribe keep fishing and never stop